Hello. Check one, two. Can we hear me? How's my voice? Let me know if I'm too loud or too quiet. Beautiful, all right. We can get started then. Hello, hi. Introducing me, Camille Koyanagi. Here's some facts about me. Here's my name. My age is, uh, I'm not quite sure. I kind of forgot, stopped counting after a while. Probably old though, I don't know. I'm 5'8 because I eat my vegetables and my fruits, and grew nice and tall and nice and strong. Uh, my Oshi mark is an umbrella and a little wave. Really cute. You can also use a jellyfish. Uh, I like jellyfish a lot, as you can see. My birthday is March 21st. Um, it's a great time of the year. It's coming up soon, this few months now. Yep, after Christmas. I speak English and only English, though that might change in the future. And my personality type is INTP, so I'm introverted. Here are some of my likes and dislikes. I love listening to the rain. I love it when it thunders. It's really relaxing to listen to. I love plants and flowers. I have plants. I have a terrarium that I take care of. It's really cute. I have like this little tiny plastic duck inside. It's adorable. I love cats. I have two cats. I have one named Kiki and one named Sunny. Um, they're both really adorable and I love them. They're my babies. Um, candles are great too. I love getting candles as gifts. I love lighting candles and I especially love the candles with wood wicks because they just sound so nice when they burn. And I like the candles, especially the ones that you don't have to light for them to smell good. Like I, I can just open it and leave it in a corner of my room and it'll make my whole room smell like roses. I also like doing puzzles. I like um, like 100 piece puzzles, like those types, but I also love like critical thinking, brain puzzles. Uh, those types of games are really fun and challenging. And I also like flea markets, but this also includes like farmer's markets too. I love going there and smelling the soaps and seeing fresh flowers or there's cheese or like bread, zucchini bread is really good. Um, it's just so fun to look at all the things they have and wander around, even if you don't buy anything. I just like it a lot. And then for my dislikes, I don't like foods you don't chew. This is like uh, pudding. Pudding is gross because it just kind of slides down your neck and you don't chew it at all. How is that a food? It's basically a liquid. I don't like hot weather because unlike cold weather where you can just throw on another layer, you can't like remove your skin to be cooler in the hot weather. I also don't like having to put sunscreen on because I'll still burn either way or I'll miss a spot and that spot will burn and it'll make me really irritated. I don't like styrofoam. It's just kind of the noise it makes when it rubs together is not good. It just don't like that. Surprises. Surprises are nice. Sometimes I appreciate the gesture, but I don't like when someone comes up with to me with a gift and it's like, here, this is for you. And I open it and I'm like, oh, thanks. Cause I just, I feel awkward when it happens, you know? It's just, I don't know how to react and I don't want to come off as being ungrateful, but somehow I, it always feels that way. And then I always feel kind of bad. Like I've hurt their feelings or something. And then coffee, coffee, I like the smell of. I don't mind when other people drink it, but I don't like drinking it myself because of the taste. It's way too strong and just caffeine in general just kind of makes me, it has one of two effects on me. It either makes me really jittery and like shaky and nervous, or it makes me sleepy. And I'll just, I, I don't understand that because it's supposed to make you energized and feel awake, but sometimes it just makes me want to take a nap. And then horror movies. I don't really like horror movies at all because Sometimes I just want a feel-good movie and horror movies are not it. They just, 
I hate sitting there curled up under a blanket and like having to hide my face whenever something scary happens. It's just not entertaining to me. It's not worth the hour or two to watch it. So I'm moving on to some of my favorite movies and anime. I like The Breakfast Club, Ferris Bueller's Day Off, and Ace Ventura Pet Detective. These are all great movies and I think everybody should watch them at least once in their life. I have watched these multiple times. I could probably recognize any quote from the movie. I just think about them a lot because they're great movies and you should always watch these because they're great. So amazing. Some other good ones are La La Land, Joy, and Baby Driver. These ones are more new, but they're still great. La La Land has won a lot of awards due to like music, choreography, and all that. It's just great. It's, it makes you sad at the end, but it's still a good ending. It's still happy, but it's bittersweet. Joy is about a woman trying to build her own business from the ground up and her struggles. And I, while I haven't seen this one as much as the other ones in my list, it always leaves an impact on me when I finish watching it. It just makes me like feel strong and powerful and confident, and I love it because it's such a good story. And then Baby Driver. Baby Driver has such a good soundtrack. It's about this boy who's a getaway driver, and it is amazing. I don't want to spoil too much, but it's just so good. I love the opening scene and how they incorporate music into each scene. Moving on to the anime, I like Spy Family, Hunter x Hunter, and Seraph of the End. These are all great. I personally think these ones are a little underrated. I know Hunter x Hunter is really popular, but in my opinion, it can never get enough attention. Um, but <laughs> they're great shows. Hunter x Hunter is long, so I haven't quite finished it yet, but I love the characters, except for the one character that we all know and hate. He is, you know who I'm talking about, not a good one. Um, but anyway, I also like the more generic ones like Attack on Titan and Jujutsu Kaisen and Demon Slayer, but I thought I should put these up here because they're kind of like less talked about ones that I thought I should mention. And here are some other good ones. I like Erased, Mob Psycho 100, and Tokyo Ghoul. Erased is really good. It's short, so you can watch it in one day if you want to, but it has such a good plot and it's so well written out and I just like it so much. It was one of the first animes I actually watched. Mob Psycho is great too because it's all about learning how to control your emotions and growth and coping with stuff. It's just such a good message and um, Reagan is a really good character. Everybody loves him. And then Tokyo Ghoul, I haven't watched the anime for this and I don't really care to, but I read all the manga and it's just great. It's one of my favorites, always will be. I cried so hard reading the last volume. Um, the characters are amazing and it's so nice to see them develop over time. So if you haven't read Tokyo Ghoul, you should give it a shot. Don't watch the anime though. Trust me, just the artwork is amazing in the manga. So give it a try. So now for my music tastes, I have a lot of different types of music that I like. I like Eve, I like Loive, I like Kali Uchis, Tyler the Creator, The Neighborhood, Red Velvet, and Notori. These are, it's a decent blend. My Spotify wrapped, I looked at that and it told me I had um, over 97 genres that I was listening to throughout the year. And that's quite a lot compared to other people, I think. Um, and for some of my top genres, although Spotify said my top was indie. I also like J-pop and J-rock, alt-rock, jazz, R&B, classic rock, and classical music. I think they're all great and, I mean, as long as it's not country, sorry to anybody out there who likes country, these are just the top ones. I don't like country. Taylor Swift fans scare me a little bit. Uh, <laughs> And then I want to say thank you to Shiba Toast. Shiba Toast has been encouraging me behind the scenes throughout this all, helping me building my confidence and just, she's the one who made my model. So if you like how my model looks, you should definitely go check them out on Twitter because they are amazing and they do great work. And now we're here. Hello, hi, how are we doing? 
Look at me. <laughs> We're going to play some Stray. I've never played this game before, but I bought it recently and I've been saving my first play for today. So we'll see how it goes. I can't wait because I love cats. I love rain! Oh, there's a kitty. There's two kitties. Oh my god, look at them. <gasps> Three kitties. Is this me? <gasps> oh my god. Oh, oh, look, look, look. So cute. Oh my god. Look at the little scruffy guy. Oh, okay. What do I do? Walk forward? Who's this? Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh, 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 buddy. Hello, friend. Oh. Aww. Aww. I have to talk to all of them. Oh. This is so cute. Okay. Now what do I do? sure what to do. No game audio? Okay, hold on. There, that should fix it. Sorry. <laughs> Am I supposed to cuddle up? Oh. Oh, look at him. Oh my god, that's so cute. Little baby. Don't skip your work session, Hilsey. Do your work. Inside the wall. We're in a wall? It's a pretty nice wall. Where are we going?
Oh, look at that. Press left alt to meow. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's so cute. Oh my god. Oh my god. Do I climb this? Or can we jump? Oh, look at that. Look at us go. Ooh. We can scratch this. Finger workout. Okay, we're good. Oh my god, I love their little meows. This is so cute. Oh. So cute. Let me go. Oh, we can jump up here. Oh, no way. Oh, we're going down there. Ah. Oh. Orange cat looks like Sunny? How do you know what Sunny looks like? How do you know? Are you a stalker? Do I have a stalker already? Oh, This is so pretty. I wish I was this cat. What are we doing over here? What is this? Oh, we're going under. Oh! Uh oh. Hmm. Careful, kitty. I don't, uh-uh, don't do it, don't, no. D no, I don't. No, no! No! Save me, save me, you losers, come on! No! 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 
Where is this? Are they calling to me? Those losers, you did nothing to save me. And I'm limping. Oh. Oh, oops. That's not good. Press Mao to pay respects. Trash bag's moving. What? Okay. This isn't as pretty as before. This is kind of gross. Can I play with this? Please. No. Oh. Where is this? Dead city? I don't want to be here. What? Security camera? Hmm. Come back here. What? Where'd they go? They were literally just there. Can anyone read this for me? I'm a little illiterate. I don't put oh. No trumpets? Why not trumpets? Hello? Too. Should I have I should have gone the other way, shouldn't I? Yep, okay. Follow me. like the security cameras. Go away. What is this? Oh, no way. 
Look at my little bucket, guys. Got a little bucket. Where am I supposed to be going? I see. Yeah! Haha. <laughs> you are no match for me, fan. Oh! Oopsie daisy! Oh, that's fun. Bye bye! <laughs> hey, wait, though. Okay, down here. What's that? Hello? The spiky things for the birds. I'm not a bird. Wasn't me. That was the other guy. Here we go. Oh, my little paw prints. A rug. Yes, I must tear this up. It's too nice a rug to leave untouched. There we go. Hmm. I wanna knock those over. Breaking and entering is okay if no one's home. In my opinion. Can anyone read this? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Whoa! There we go. Hmm. I'll just go this way. Stop scaring me. And then just disappearing. Where the heck did you go? Not funny. Up. Just. Oh. That's not terrifying at all. Oh. Did I kill it? Mm. He dead in Dead City. Stay back. Ugh. Leave me alone. 
Oh, stay away. Ah. Ah. Go away. Ah, left alt. Oh, no. No. I was pressing left control. <laughs> Let's try that again. <laughs> Go away. I gotta do the zigzag, throw them off. Zigzag, zigzag. You can't get me. Oh. Oh, no, no, no. Left out, left out, left out, left out, left out, left out! <laughs> there were too many. <laughs> Can I not run faster than this? I don't think this is fast enough. What are these little things? They're like squishy too. They're robotic and squishy looking. And I don't like it. Here we go. Go away, go away, go away, go away. Go away, I'm moving, I'm moving, go away, go away, go away. Guys, guys, I swear to God, I'm a good gamer. I swear. I swear I'm a real gamer. Already? Already! Gotta dodge. Zigzag, zigzag, come on. Oh god. No, stay stay back. Stay away. Come on, come on. We can do this. We can do this. Nope, 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 no, no. Keep running. Keep running. Keep No 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 This is harassment. Nope. You're not gonna get me. Nope. 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 Why are you trying to eat me? I'm just a cat. I probably don't taste good. Get off! Why is this so hard? Back off, back off! Nope, we're going through here. No, 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 no! Get off! I'm actually doing well this time, okay. Nope, dodge, dodge. Oh, oh, jump. They can't get me now. They can't get me. Oh, okay. I'm safe for now. Oh my god. Oh my god. I made it. I'm scared now. <laughs> I hear them. I hear the little bugs.
trying to get over there. There we go. And over here. Hell yeah, baby. Climb this. No. Hey oh. How do I get up there? I'm a little stuck. This should be climbable. I really feel like that should be climbable. Maybe there's something in here I can use. Maybe. It just looks like garbage. Aha! There we go! Oh my god, you guys. Big brain moment. I can hear the security cameras moving and it bothers me. <laughs> First real jump scare. Jump over there. Oh, I see. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. There we go. Don't break on me, please. <laughs> Really? Really? I don't really like this.
Are we finally getting somewhere? Isn't this just where I was? Oh, I see, okay. Did that just fall down? Okay, where's my bucket? Let's find a bucket. Oh, it's a button. That's pretty handy. Okay. All right, here we go. The flat. Oh my god. Moo cow. Need help? Really? <laughs> That's interesting. Download? Enter the door. Find a body. Find a body. I don't know if I want to find a body. No. No, I don't want to find a body. Hello? Are you kidding me? magnifying glass. Hello. Okay. Let's just put this here for now. Take this. No one's using it. Is that code cool? No, put this here. Here. Yes. The last one it looks like that. Controls, controls, controls. <gasps> Secret tunnel! Secret tunnel! Through the mountains! Secret, 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 secret tunnel! Whoa! 
I don't. Oh, okay. What is this? Batteries? Some sort? Where did they go? That is the question. Here? Well, that door's closed now. Oh! Guess I should follow these arrows, huh? That'd be helpful. What? Guess they're not batteries. Awkward silence. <laughs> Oh, that's so interesting. It worked. I'm free, thank you. Couldn't believe the cameras. A cat in the dead city? You were watching me? You were watching me, you stalker? I can't remember my name, it seems my memory is corrupted. That's... a you problem. I'm trapped in the electronic network for so long. I know I worked for a scientist who lived here. For now, you can call me B12. That's what it says on my exterior. It's dangerous in the dead city, you know, but you seem like you know how to handle yourself. Let's get out of here. Follow me. Okay. Guess I'm gonna follow you. That key unlocks a door. I remember that much. Let me get that for you. That would be very helpful, thank you. Very good. Battery low already, wow. Do you need to charge? You're going to have to put this on. Put what on? Is that a backpack? Oh! My cat would hate that. Okay. <laughs> That's how cats walk when you put anything on them. <laughs> oh my god. This is so accurate. Kiki would hate this one. Sonny, I don't know. We haven't tried putting clothes on him yet. Mow! Ah. Oh. Too heavy for a little guy to handle. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> for small quadrupeds like you, ah. Oh. Is this uncomfortable for you? Yes. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. Oh, okay. I've digitized the key and stored it in the backpack. Press tab to open the inventory. Oh, look at that, some keys. Hmm, keys. Stop, examine, exit. Cool. Easy peasy. If you're ever curious about an object, you can show it to me. Or to others, if we come across any. Now let's get out of this flat. Agreed. I don't like this. How do we get out, though? Is it this way? 
It's this door, right? Oh, no way! Do it, yep. Select an item to use. Use item. Handy dandy. Press 2 to use torchlight. Oh, that's handy! No way! Wow! Alright, we can open this too, right? Input! Those look like numbers we could put in. Oh, there's also some numbers there. Oh, okay. Oh, piano. Oh, that's handy. Three, seven, four, eight. Three, seven, four, eight. Hell yeah, baby. Or at least for real. Oh my god. Wow, look at this place. The elevator. It's important, you think. I know we need to go up. Okay. Let's take this little bucket trolley then. Wee! Woohoo! Oh my god. Look, he's so cute. Oh. What is all that down there? Where's that elevator? Wait, I remember. The outside, the outside, ooh. Feels like I've been there before. Is this where you come from? I promised someone I would go there. Promise too. I don't know. This postcard, the mural was painted from it. Let's take it. Oh, I guess we're gonna take it. Game new item! Postcard. Why do I have these memories? How did they get here? Let's keep going. Okay. Oh, memory. Bucket. It's those little mouse thingies. Ew, look at them. Translate. Safe zone. Really? Doesn't look that safe. Okay, let's, let's go then. Yeah, that doesn't look safe down there. I don't want to get out. Ooh, no, no, no. Can they jump? Please tell me they can't jump. I don't even want to look back. The slums? I... I... Th that doesn't look good either. I don't want to... I'm gonna get you. Oh! 
Okay. What's that? Can I hide in the bucket? Uh, hey, that was rude. Excuse me. Where am I supposed to go? Why? You guys don't like cats? What is that? Oh, just a statue. Seriously, come on, you don't like cats? Hello? Let me in, hey! running from me Are we going to fight? Okay, they're friendly. Okay. I don't know, that kind of face looks a little evil though. Meat. Hello. Yeah. They seem to have their own language. You're no Zerk. We're not familiar with your kind. You are welcome in your village, as long as you don't eat anyone. I don't think I'll eat anyone. Faces. You lost. What do you need? Show item. Show item. Oh, the picture of the outside. Ridiculous. This elevator isn't operational. Everyone knows that it is impossible to leave this place. Well, except the outsiders. But they're all gone now. Except Momo. Who's Momo? You can try to talk to him if you want, but he gave up on trying to leave. It's for the best. He lives high up in that building with the orange neon sign. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm the merchant of the market. What do you have then? Give me something and I'll give you something in exchange. It's as simple as that. This is an ancient relic, a testament to the talent of our ancestors. What is it? <laughs> is it a painting? It will cost you three energy drink cans. I can't do less. Nope, sorry, I won't accept that. Okay. I don't need electric cables. Music sheet, I don't play music. Here. 
I'm just exploring right now. I don't really... Those aren't stars, those are lights. Wow. That's unsettling. Oh, what was I saying? Oh, Momo. I will talk to Momo, but I want to explore. You've got some interesting hair there. <gasps> a guitar. Can you play me something? Hello, I'm a musician, but I don't have any songs. Are you kidding? A blue sky. Ha. Huh. I will write about that. I'll write a song about that one day. Can play something. Oh. That's so cute. Oh. Look at the little baby. So cute. What's this? I think the controls were reversed because now when I put the bag on, it's hard to move around. I want to put it back on. Let me put it back on. <laughs> Ooh. Take safe's mystery password. You said salmon. I can't read that. It's written follow the numbers, but it looks like a binary language. It's a su succession uh, of ones and zeros. We must be able to decipher this code in one way or another. It is probably related to this safe. I could probably examine it. It's a plant dude. Roshi, I take care of the plants. The humans improve them so much. Now they require very little light. I just add a bit of water and chill- and look how big they get. It's really an amazing technology? I don't know about you, but plants aren't technology. Let's show him the item, though. The outside? Why bother trying to find it? We're good here. Oh, okay. Meow 100 times. I just got an achievement for meowing 100 times. Where are all these people? You gave us such a fright, we thought you were a zerk. What's a zerk? Are you sleeping? Huh. You really thought you'd take the elevator? I've never seen that thing work, and I'll be 374 years old tomorrow. Well, happy early birthday. Why go up there? There's nothing there. Oh, okay. I don't want to talk with you guys. You guys are very pessimistic. Our long gone ancestors, the soft ones. Left us the city. Our home is their legacy. Okay. It's an interesting painting. Okay, let's go find Momo.
Uh, get up there. What, how? <laughs> That was a big jump. What are you doing? Okay. <gasps> a bucket! Can I get anywhere else though? It just disappears, okay. Please don't bother Bora, she's so clumsy. Oh, is that where we need to get to? Let me in! His robe. <laughs> Why is he sad? Moo, it's another cow. Moo. It's never going to work. Why did I let them go? I'm all alone. Aww. Hey you, what do you want? Do you know anything about this? Only a real geek can read this? Oh, darn. This is a picture of the outside. Do you want to go there? Yes. Well, don't bother. It's a waste of time. It'll only bring you loneliness and despair. Why are you guys so depressing? Jeez. My friends had this dream too, but now they're gone and I'm all- Where did they go? Did they escape? Oh, okay. I don't know where they ended up. I tried to contact them, but that- Bleep! Transceiver doesn't work. My friends and I took our notes out- Took our notes about the outside. Here, take mine if you really want to go out there. You're on your own. I'm done with the outside. Good luck. Oh. Momo seems very sad. He misses his friends. Let me check the notebook he gave us. The Outsider's Manifesto. We must go to the outside at any cost. We must protect our brothers and sisters. We must stay away from Zerks. It's signed Clementine, Saul, Zvaltar, Doc, and Momo. It looks like Momo's name was added later. I think we should find the other notebooks. How am I supposed to find other notebooks? Oh boy. Hey little cat, are you still looking for those useless notebooks? Yeah, a little bit. Can you... Oh, I, th I thought I was holding the code. Oopsie. Yes! Controls do get reversed, this is hard, okay. That's long. 
Earth versus the fifth planet from the sun. Third. Shoot. And the fifth largest in the solar system by mass and diameter. Fun fact, hey. guys. Jump scare. Um, can you mute the BGM, please? Yes, I can. I'm actually going insane listening to it. <laughs> okay, I'm going back on Devin. Okay. Today is the only celestial object known to foster life. According to the radiometric dating, the Earth is 4.5 billion years old. It has a single natural satellite, the Moon, which was formed soon after. The gravitational interaction with the Moon creates tides, stabilizes the stabilizes Earth's axis of rotation, and gradually reduces its rotation speed. That's cool. Bit of a mouthful, though. Can I jump on these? Scratchy, scratchy, scratchy. Sheet music. I can't get up there. Food? Cats gotta eat. Remember. Oh, back home too, I remember this video game. It was made just after I was created, I think. I can't remember it well. The scientist and I spent a lot of time playing it. It was fun. I miss him. Why can't I remember his name? I don't know. Problem. <laughs> the symbol on the wall matches the one on the notebook. Oh. That seems like a lead. Thank you, that's helpful. I had no idea where I was going to go. Let's jump in this bucket. What are we doing out here? Those two- those circles of light are pleasing to watch, but I want to see the real sky one day. Aww. Look at the cozy little boy. Oh, stretch. Is up there. Oh, is that the elevator? Interesting. Hello? I don't see any notebooks in here yet. What? Oh, there it is. 
it is. An outsider notebook. It's the same logo as the one Momo gave us. This one seems to belong to someone named Clementine. Everything is going according to plan. We managed to contact, uh, contact, contact, why can't I scroll? Contact the upper level before the transceiver went down. They are in a place called Midtown and it's apparently controlled by some kind of oppressive force. I talked to Momo earlier, his eyes, I know this look. He will not come with us. Let's find the other notebooks. Okay. Is there anything else here we can take? Music sheet. We should go over here next because that has the same symbol. Oops. Oops, hold on. <laughs> That's two notebooks, only one to go. We have to look in the abandoned flats of the area. You should be able to see them all from the rooftops. Look for an outsider logo. Cool. <laughs> Oopsie. Sorry. Oops. <laughs> yup. I was just in there, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Careful there, little guy. Jump. Just want to grab this. Water. What is that? Is that a vape? Don't vape, it's bad for your lungs. Can I not jump over there? Oh, here we go. But I was just over here. Did I miss something?
What? Maybe I should translate this. Ventilation power supply. Okay. Thank you for that. Maybe there's something in the boxes? Nice work, another notebook. This one seems to belong to someone named Spaltar. I don't know how to pronounce that. All trace of organic life has disappeared except for what we call the Zerks. They seem to be... They seem to eat almost anything that moves and breed at an inconceivable rate, as if being locked in the city wasn't hard enough. Let's find the other notebooks. There's only one more to go, right? So we went there, we went there. Hmm. <laughs> There's still that poor neighbor. He's still looking at the lights. Yeah, they're pretty all right. <laughs> I love how amused they get. Who's this guy? He looks like a nerd. Oh, hey, it's you. You do look weird and small, but there's something about you. I feel compelled to pet you, but I won't because I don't understand why. <laughs> Only a real... Can you point me in the direction of a real geek? Scratchy, scratchy. What is that? Oops. I wanna go up. Oh wait, there's soda in here. Energy drink, speed 2K. Yeah, all right. There's a lot of books in here. They okay. How develop your artificial intelligence in order to be as creative as a real human? Volume 42. 
Or at least... Hello. Cozy little boy. Space. Oh, I can get up there. <laughs> it's just jiggling. This is cool. Hey doc, I found the keys to your safe. You need to be more careful with these. Oh, sweet. It's not enough to bury your safe behind a bunch of books. Just the librarian. That sounds awful. I think I need to get up there. Wait. Safe hidden behind a bunch of books. Maybe that's what I'm looking for. Already translated that. Wait. <gasps> There it is! Aha! Ah, uh, keys, where are the keys? Yes. Finally, the last notebook. This one seems to belong to someone named Doc. After weeks of research, I've combined a spectrometer spectrometer with a powerful UV lamp. With this, we should be able to we should be capable of warding off the Zerks on our way out. The initial attempt was explosive. I might have to test it under real conditions. Oh, there's also a note in his notebook in this book. It says, I found a design flaw in the transceiver, but I think I figured out how to fix it. Here's the equation. With this, we should be able to help Momo repair the transceiver. If it can, can communicate with the upper levels, that could be our way up. Let's show them what we found. Oh, how do we get out of here now? Oh. 
Back to Momo's. Oh. I press space without thinking about where I'm actually going. Hello? Anybody home? Where'd that paper bag go? Ugh, I want to put it on. Yeah. Momo. Hey, little cat. Are you still looking for those useless notebooks? Actually. Should show them one by one? Never quite understood what he was talking about most of the time, but he was very, very wise. Okay. Oh, it belonged to Doc? He was really a huge nerd for electronics and stuff. He was always on the verge of a great discovery. And then... Yeah, this one. Wait, you actually found all my friend's notebooks? Oh yeah, baby. What's that note? The transceiver can be repaired? This is incredible! That means we should be able to communicate with outside of the slums. Clementine's a Walter Doc. I'm sorry I doubted our cause. I promise you. I'll promise you. I will find a way to reach the surface. Thank you. We might be able to find you a way up. Now let's fix this piece of drunk transceiver. Look at him go. Et voila, it works. Come with me. Okay, where are we going? Can somebody please buy me a robe like his? This is so great, I love the flamingos. Up there, see that building high above the others? No. If you install the transceiver at the very top of that tower, we should be able to communicate with the whole city. My friends might still be out there. If there's a way out, they'll know it. Cool. You're the only one small and quick enough to evade the Zerks. We need you, little outsider. Bring us to the sky. Are the little Zerks those mouse thingies that were chasing me? Oh, bye. you're gonna lock me out? Hey! Aww. Oh, I like this lantern. Fuck it. Is that the building I need to get to? Top of there. Rooftops. We're in a new area. Oh nah. Nah, I don't I don't deal with those guys. Nope, sorry, nope. Find me another way over there, buddy. Can I get them to fall in? Come on, just jump down. You can do it. Just jump. Oh, I got one down there. Oops. Alright. Let's get out of here. Going up there. What's that noise? Oh, shoot. Okay, nope. We're going away. Get! Are you kidding me? Go away! Don't jump up here. No! 
Aua! Aua! <laughs> I think those little thingies are the Zerks. Why is this kind of like blue? Oh, okay, remember. Memory. The city is full of neon. It wasn't always this way. There used to be strict energy caps, especially in the slums, but people couldn't handle the constant darkness. One day someone lit up rainbow lamps, neon signs all over their play their house. That person was taken away and never seen again, but people saw hope and not long after everybody started putting lots of lights in their homes. There was nothing the oppressors could do. It was a way for people to see colors again, like on the outside. I think it helped. Am I missing memories? Is that why they're gray down there? Did I miss some down in the slums? Okay, where to next? Okay, okay. Oh! Easy there. Maybe I... Yeah, here we go. Swing all the way over. Where do I need to go? Oh, over here. Okay. Jump swing up here. Oh, I can hear them down there. I don't like it. Getting close to the tower, though. Oh. I don't want to go down there. Nah. No, 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 no. They're climbing the frickin' fence? What? Huh? Left out, 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 Okay. I don't know if I wanna... Will this one close? I could hack it again, but then I'd have to make a run for it. Oh, okay. That's good. Hell yeah! Suck it! That should be good enough. Oh, oh it's sticky! Makes a little sound. Oh wow. Look at me. Ooh.
Okay, up here. We're gonna go through that little vent. like this music oh stop I don't want to be attacked by the little blurby things <laughs> oh. okay let's make a game plan I'll jump down but then where do I go from there do I go over that way I think I'll be safe inside this little area here because of these pipes for a little bit at least because these guys can jump oh don't make that squishy sound please okay i could navigate through these but i think it'll make a oh, okay nope we're running nope running 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 getting away Getting away. No, there's more. Oh, God. God, please. Oh. Okay, I go over there. Go, 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 kitty. No, 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 go, jump. I'm so done with these little things. Okay. It looks like I need that bucket for something. That tin container. Do I push it out there? You guys are weird. Stop it. Freaking me out. Why are they just. I don't know. I. Please stay away, please. Guys, I'm kind of hungry. Pizza sounds good. Oh no, no. Run, run, run. Oh, that's a big jump. Ooh. Pizza, yes, I want pizza, pizza, pizza. I don't even think I have a frozen pizza, I just... 
Maybe tomorrow I'll go to the store and buy one. Frozen pizzas. Frozen pizza is underrated, honestly. No, 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 no. Get off of me. Where am I supposed to be going? Help. <laughs> Help me. Oh god. No, 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 get off, get off. Get away! No, 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 get away. <laughs> oh, please. Please, just stop. This... Frozen pizza tastes like fridge? No. Frozen pizza tastes like pizza. Come on. Come on, open, please. <laughs> please. Here it is. Put the transceiver on this antenna. Cool. This is very tedious. Look, the view. It's beautiful from here. I remember now, the city. It was meant to be a shelter. Those look like stars, but they're only light markings of the hermetic roof ceiling off the city. Humankind built this shell to protect themselves from the outside, but it came at a cost. <clears throat> Excuse me. Nobody can go out. The outside was a disaster, completely barren, unalive, and dangerous. <clears throat> but if you come from there, it must mean it's safe again. And my promise wasn't just to go to the outside, it was to open the city. I still don't understand why some memories are coming back and some aren't. But I'm certain this is my purpose. I have to open the city. Come on, let's go back and find Momo. Now that we've connected the transmitter, we should be able to get help. Sweet! Little bucket ride. Delicious. Them boys on rock rock, so delicious. They want a slice of what I got, Burgalicious. Momo, we're back. Meow meow. The slums part two. Why is the toy like in the floor? Strange. Where's Momo? Look, a note. Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there. I've locked the window, but the code to it to open it is quite simple. It is. Uh 
Mm, you can remember that. I'm not gonna remember that. Be careful. It is case sensitive. See you at the bar, Momo. That must be the code for the window near the entrance. Let's go. All right. The bar. Where's the bar? The code was... Uh... It was an H, I think. Error, wrong key. Oops, my bad. Let's try that again. Mm. Was it O or a zero? Let's see. Success. Thank you. <laughs> Momo's at the bar waiting for us. Where's the bar? Oh, is that Momo? I'm up here. Hey, little furball. Come here, I managed to get a signal. That thing is ancient. Oh, he wants me to sit on the stool with it. Oh my god. Oh, the head bats. Oh. Let me see if I can get this thing working. <laughs> okay. Almost got it. Hello! Can anyone hear me? Yes, we can hear you. We are from the slums. We are looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you, Zalpar? Momo? Psh! I, I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes, Psh! we are safe. Psh! We found a way up. Psh! Hello? Do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Sewers? Very dangerous. Psh, zerks everywhere. Psh. Sewers, how? Hello? Darn it. We've lost the signal. I can't believe it. He's out there. And the other outsiders managed to go up through the sewers? The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums, but if Zaltar made it, there must be a way. Weather? Oh, who's this guy? Eavesdropper. Seamus. You'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with zerks. They'll make a quick meal out of you, especially you, little one. Many tried to look in the past. Doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you. Your business is none of my business. Mm, famous. His father, Doc, used to be great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. Thanks, bartender. Can he give me a glass of milk, please? Don't listen to Seamus. He's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue in Seamus' apartment. Come on, follow me. Now we're breaking and entering. Can I get a drink though? Hey buddy. You're new around here, what can I do for you? Can- Oh, I want a drink. A little glass of milk, please. Ah, oh, look at this smile. He looks like he's hiding something under there. He's guilty. Look at that face. He's so guilty. He's hiding something. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> That's a nice hat. Oh my god, it's a cowboy! You wanna be a cow- He's still- Cleaning the paint? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm cleaning the porch of my shop again. 
Stop playing over my shop, you clumsy rascal. Sorry. Little paw prints. Who is this? He's shady. Remember, remember. R.I.P. humans. Oh man. Art. Humans were the first residents around here. It seems that they're all dead now. What do you think it feels like being dead? I don't know. I know it's silly coming from me, but are they actually at peace? Will I be at peace when I die? I don't know what death feels like for an AI. I'm sorry. I didn't want to break the mood. Let's move on. Are we seriously going to break and enter? You know your father would have wanted to help us. He's going to make me climb in there, isn't he? Well, that was to be expected. This situation is pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me. But you... I think I have an idea. I don't like your idea. I don't like it. Look at that graffiti. It's like a worm. Dude! Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. Oh, thanks. It contains a lot of inter information that will hopefully act as an electroshock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to reestablish communications with the others. Really? Is that him there? Yeah, that's him. I think it is time to quit. Yes. It's been just about two hours, guys. We're gonna go back here. Sorry. I'll get the music going again, though. Alright, hi, hello. How do we like the game? I liked playing as a cat. But those zerks were really, really annoying. And that first time trying to outrun them, that was... <laughs> that was a little frustrating. I think... I've got the hang of it now. I gotta spam left alt. Like a maniac. Anyway, that was a fun game to play. I liked the robots. What are they called? They're not called humans, they're just AI, I think? I don't know, they were kind of cute. I love the little faces they made when you meow at them. They're so cute. Little robot people. That's gonna be us one day. We're all going to turn into robots. Anyways, chat, do you have any questions for me since this is my first stream? I didn't really pause after my slideshow, so if there's anything you want to ask me, you can ask me now. <clears throat> sorry about my voice, though. It's a little sore. Yeah, sorry, stream's ending. It's been two hours. Seven o'clock on the dot. I guess you gotta go take bathroom breaks faster, Hilsey. Have I eaten jellyfish? Why would I eat jellyfish? I am a jellyfish guardian. I protect them. I love jellyfish. They're so cute, but I don't eat them. I like jelly, like PB&Js. Those are pretty good. I used to be one of those kids who 
didn't like strawberry jelly. I loved grape jelly. It was my favorite. I recently went through my freezer to clean it out and there was a bunch of Uncrustables. I used to eat those things all the time in elementary. Like, I would go through so many. <laughs> I had to throw them away though because I think they had freezer burn. Because they, they had been there for a few years and they just never got thrown out. So, <laughs> it was about time. Full body model reveal. Okay, yeah, I probably should show the full picture. Alright, ready? Okay, I have my model locked. Oh, okay, here we go. Here I am. Camille jellyfish. We can look at the whole body. Here's my shoes. A few years, yeah, the, they just never got ate. Nobody ate them, so they were sitting there for a few years. I didn't want to eat them. If I want PB and J, I'll just make PB and J myself. So here's the skirt. You can see the jellyfish design here. Uh, thank you, Shiba Toast, for designing it. Everybody say thank you, Shiba. Got a little seashell there and some gloves and painted nails. And a pretty necklace and a little bow on the side there. And seashell earrings. And little pearl decorations. And look at my eyes. Blink, blink. Aren't they so pretty? I've got... Oh, I've got a big forehead too. That's my big brain, guys. Look at my big brain. Humongous. <laughs> Are my eyes so like glossy though? See how far we can zoom in. I think that's as far as we can go. <laughs> but look at my hat, it glows. Isn't it cute? Little crown. Okay, time to go back to normal size. Where was I? Was I about like right here? I think that looks normal. Oh, I think it was smaller. But that's a good size. Okay, let's go back to the game and see how big it is. Oh, that's pretty big. That's pretty big. So I should be a bit smaller. Right there. There. Seem about right? Yeah. It's a little small, but okay. 300 IQ, yeah, that's me. Big brain Camille. What'd you guys think of the game? Should I play it again? I think it was pretty fun. The little robot that follows us is pretty cute. And I love the backpack that we got. I could also play, what kind of games do I have? Uh, Genshin Impact. I have Genshin Impact, Honkai Star Rail, um, I have Doki Doki Literature Club. I've heard really good things about it, but I just haven't played it yet because, um, I have to- I will finish the game on stream then, okay? If you guys like it, I will finish it. I want to finish it anyway, but if you guys want to see me finish it, then I will. Uh, what was I saying? Uh, Doki Doki Literature Club. I could play that on stream as well. Um, I don't know much about it, other than it starts off cute and then it gets like really crazy horror stuff, I'm not sure, but it looks good and I've heard great things about it, so. Is that an appropriate thing to play on stream? <laughs> Should I be playing something like that? Or is it... Mm. I don't know guys. Let me check my Steam real quick. I can see uh, what else I have to play. That was my Alexa. Shh. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, I'm looking for it. Scroll. Steam. There's Steam. Steam. I have Cattails, another cat game. That one's really fun. It's a little pixely. It's not very story-based. It's kind of just like, do whatever you want to do. Uh, I also have Resident Evil 2 and 3, the remakes. I bought those recently and I haven't played them. Octopath Traveler. I've played that a little bit before, but that was like years ago. Um, but I kind of stopped playing because it's really, you have to grind at it to get farther and level up. It takes a while. I should play Val. Valorant? I'm not good at Valorant. <laughs> I've tried before. I always forget to crouch when I shoot. And I'm not quick enough to pull out my gun and stuff. Valorant's one of those games where you have to play for a while to get really good. And then once you're good, like you have to memorize the maps and stuff and then get like even better and practice even more. It's just, eh. Resident Evil, I want to play that too. I don't know much about it. I should play that sometime. I also have Final Fantasy VII, the remake, um, and I want to play that. I have had Baldur's Gate on my wish list for a few months now. It looks amazing. Um, I hear it's got so much story to play. And the characters are really cool. There's a lot of character customization, but the game's $60. So maybe after Christmas, if I get like a gift card or something, then I'll buy it. Cause I bought a lot of games recently and I've also bought a lot of dollars worth of Christmas gifts. But Christmas is coming up. It's December 1st, which means it's 24 days away. I dissed my entire channel. Do you guys all play Valorant? Yeah, Baldur's Gate is $60, but it's one of like those games that I think you can play for hours and hours and there's still content. And like, if you replay it too, there's different outcomes. It's really well made. I've seen some clips and it's pretty funny too. Kiki, can you guys hear my cat meowing? Mao. He wants attention. Steam sale. Yes, I bought a lot of games when there was a sale recently, um, around Black Friday. And I think I spent like $50, but since Baldur's Gate is new, it came out in August, it hasn't gone on sale. But it looks really good. The character designs are amazing. Oh, also, uh... New game, Lethal Company. I have been thinking about buying that since it's only like $10. Is it good? Does anyone play that? It looks pretty fun. Yeah, it's only $10. It kind of reminds me of Among Us, but more cooperative, I guess. The white haired guy. From Baldur's Gate? Yeah. <laughs> I've seen a lot of TikToks of him. He, he seems pretty cool. I like men that talk all fancy and stuff. Lethal Company, yes. I have a few friends that play, so I might get that and play with them because it looks like a lot of fun. I'm looking at it right now on Steam. And it, people say it's like kind of scary, but just more like jump scare stuff. Collab, who would I collab with? I'm, this is my first day of streaming. I don't have streamer friends. Oh, Elden Ring would be fun to play too. I'm just looking through my wish list on Steam right now. Poppy Playtime. I could play that on stream. I could play that. 
That one's free. Oh, Mogus. Request more friends. Maybe I could get Shiba to join me. Shiba would play. That was the voice that we heard earlier telling me to turn off BGM. Shiba, the voice is in my head. Okay, what else is there? I mean, I could play Five Nights at Freddy's. I've never played that before. Stardew Valley is really fun to play, but I feel like that's more... Like, it's not as entertaining to stream, you know? It's just more of a relaxing kind of thing. Hypothetically, Shiba doesn't have her model rigged. Yeah, we could just give her a little 2D sprite, though. And put her in the corner. A little chibi Shiba. Five Nights at Freddy's. I haven't seen the movie. Has anyone seen the movie? I think it's out on Peacock, so I could watch it. But I just don't know. PNG tuber. Yes. Shiba could be just a little icon in the corner. Oh, I've also played Hades. I don't know if you can hear it, but it's kind of... The trailer just started playing. Um, Hades is really good. They're coming out with the second game. It's so fun. Yeah, you can hear it. Okay, sorry. <laughs> but I love the character design. It's so good. It's just like... Uh... I've never played a game like... I've never played a dungeon crawler like that or a roguelite. How do you... Whatever it's called. But play Tetris? I can play Tetris. I'm good at Tetris. Hades, yes, Hades. I have it on my Switch. I do not have it on PC. But I would not be opposed to buying it on PC as well because it's just that fun. I mean, I've put so much time into that game, but it's just so fun. Like, no matter what you do, there's always, you can always just keep improving. Play Hollow Knight. I have not played Hollow Knight before. Let me look that up. Hollow Knight. I think I've seen pictures before. Oh. Yeah, yeah. I've seen this before. Uh, it looks like fun. Good reviews. Good price. I'll put it on my wish list. Omori. Oh, Omori. I'll put that one on my wish list too. Omori. I have also not played that one, but I want to because it just looks good. Omori gives me war flashbacks. <laughs> you have PTSD from Omori? I get it's like psychological stuff but is it really that bad it doesn't look graphic borrow shiba's steam account hmm 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 yes maybe maybe i could do that Anyway, I had fun playing uh, Stray. I promise I won't play it on my own. I'll only play it on stream. But for now, actually, my stream schedule, I don't really know what that looks like because this week I have... I mean, maybe I'll be able to play Thursday night. 
But for now, it's just kind of up in the air because it's the last week before winter break for me. So there's a lot going on. I'll still be on Twitter and stuff if you want to talk to me on there. But um, for now, I think this is where I'm going to stop for tonight. So bye bye guys. Thanks for coming to my stream, my first ever stream. I really appreciate it and I hope to see you all next time. Have a good night or day.